Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to the plug. So, I haven't posted in a while, but today I'm going to be showing you my new microscope. This is a Bresser microscope. It's really nice. Um, <coughs> it goes up to four, four times, ten times, and forty times magnification. Um, has um, light color filters. Um, has three power sets of light, so there's one light right here, and then also right here is light. This moves up and down, um, and this dims um, what you're seeing here. Um, this is a really nice microscope. I got it on Amazon for $89.99, and um, it also came with all of this stuff. So, let me move this. So oh, it also came with these. So, so it has um it came with slides. Um it came with about five slides right here with the ready to think. Then it came with a bunch of slides for you to create your own. It came with two cleaning cleaning things. Um <coughs> it also came with a fake knife, some tweezers, and this little thingy, I don't know what it is. Um, a plastic pipette. It also came with three lenses, um, two specimen bottles, vials, some shrimp hatchery kits, and this little um, thing to put stuff in. So, oh yeah, and it also came with one of these. Um, you stick it like this, and you put your phone on it, or your laptop in it, and these things stick. So, let's get in the video <coughs> so how to work this um this thing is all made out of metal right here this is like strong plastic <coughs> so um how to get it ready is i recommend starting right here on the four times um so first what you do is it usually comes with the lid on so you take out this okay um make sure not to lose that unless you just want to keep this i guess so um so you can either choose um you need you take this big one and you put it in right here all right so now i have another hole then you have these two so you have 10x and 20x um i usually use the 10x it has a bigger piece for your eyes to see this one's smaller and it is um it's not as zoomed in so i'm gonna put this one in the 10x and i'll leave this one all right <coughs> then what you want to do is you can choose something to look at like um first i'm going to start with this crystal so um it has if you do want to have a slide for example, the epidermis onion, right, right, it's kind of hard to see, right, there you can see that purple-ish, yeah, so what you want to do is you have these little tabs to lift it up, so you want to do that, and then you have this hole right here, you're going to want to slide this right under, Try to get the onion piece right in the very middle. Um, and also be very careful with these. These are glass slides. <coughs> and then, yeah. So, I'm going to look at my crystal first. So, I'm just going to set it right here. And then I take these. Um, the light switches right here. Um, there is one which just turns on this bottom light right here and then there's two which also turns off this top light just in case you know this light is being blocked but and it turns this light off and then there's three which is all it which is both of them so i'm just going to use two right now the this one right here because um this thing is already blocking the light so what you do is all you do is you look in here and you move you move this up and down 
Um, if you have a lower thing, it's usually higher up because of um, the lower magnification. So you just look in, um, you can usually see it, and then you find like the perfect part where it magnifies. Let me get it magnified to show you just an example of where you see. So this is the four times, pretty close. But then if you move it to the 10 times, it's obviously longer and has better mag a closer magnification. I'm gonna have to move it. Oh, let's see. So this is a 10 times magnification. It's even closer right here. And then the 40 times. Um, the 40 times is usually pretty hard because <coughs> if you have something on the slides, you have to get it right over this right here um, for it to zoom in. So it's not broken if you can never find anything. It's just you have to be really, um, you have to get it just in the right spot. So yeah, so I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like through this with this. So what you do with the phone holder is I recommend only phones with like one camera. If you have two, that might work. But three cameras, it's always hard because um, the third camera and second stick out. So when you try to zoom in with one, it zooms around this, then zoom out. So you do, you put it on, right? Or you can, you take out, you put on like this basic camera app and you put it right on top of the camera like this. Make sure it's all pushed on. So I'll do this right now to give you guys a good example. <coughs> so now that it's pushed on right there, you're gonna choose a slide. So I'm gonna do the onion, all right? Um, so yeah, we just do the same thing. Sorry, it kind of looks weird right now. Um, so you just slide it on right here, all right? All right, so I'm gonna have to move this just a bit to get it in the right position. Um, but yeah, this should look cool. First, I will, oh yeah, I'm gonna just change it to four times so far. So, oh dang it, it came off. Okay, let me try this one more time. Um, is that good? Yeah. You want to make sure it's tight on there, so when you try to take pictures or videos, just like me, um, this doesn't happen again, hopefully. <coughs> so I'm just going to lift it up to show you. Okay. Okay. Um, okay, that. Alright. So here it goes. Make sure these don't fall out. So right now I can't really see anything just quite yet. Um, okay. Oh, that's weird. Why is it like that? Okay. Nothing. So what? What you do is you just put that on. Oh, the slide wasn't on there, right? Okay. So you just slide it like that. Why is it not? There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna, first I'm gonna dim the brightness because it's pretty bright right now. I have no idea why it keeps on doing that. There we go. Okay, I'm going to dim the brightness. Um, let me see. This thing isn't... <coughs> this usually works. So... Gonna clean this. Nothing blocking this or anything. I'm gonna get 
the slide ready right now. I'm gonna find um, the right settings so I don't have to do it while looking at the camera. Um, let's see. Okay, I found it. All right. Let's hope this works. One last time. Set that there. There we go. <coughs> All right, let's hope this stays. Yeah, it works. You can just turn on the brightness. That's up. Okay, there is an onion. I have four times. Very cool. Um, well, thank you for watching this video on how to work a rester microscope. Um, here, let me show you the box. Right here. Um, leave a comment down below if you have any questions on how to work it, and I will try to help you. And, um, also leave a comment on things that you want me to look at. I have housefly legs. I have cotton. Stem of cotton. I have pine mature wood. Stem of wood. Um, some cotton. I also have a house fly leg. There it is right there. There's a house fly leg. It looks crazy at 40 times. So, um, make sure to leave a like if you want to see it and comment down below what you want to see. And it doesn't have to be in this side set. Um, so yeah, just let me know. Um, thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And, yeah, bye.